Hi, everybody. This is Jeffrey. This is Ripe Color, and I'm turning up the volume. That should help. Okay. Um, this is your reading for uh, August 5th. Friday. Uh, Friday. Thursday. Thursday. <laughs> uh, please like, subscribe, share, comment, press the bell for notifications. Maybe it'll help me remember what day of the week it is. Uh, I'm working on scarves. I, if I'm wearing this, that means I'm going to work today, or I have the intent to work. Um, it's very cloudy, but it's kind of nice for a change. And let's see what's going on for the fifth. Things are really changing for me in a very big way. Uh, much more quiet, much more interior, much more, um, I don't know what the word is, comforted. You have to work at it, you know, you have to work at it. And I got a new ring light. I don't know if the lighting, if you see it, the lighting is different, but I, it's like, um, I have different settings. It's very exciting. It's like a makeup mirror. So I'm doing the natural light, I think. <laughs> it's not, you know, it's not like there's a button that says this, this, and this. I wish there were, but there isn't. Anyway, that's that. My old one uh, went kaput. Okay. And what I'm getting more and more for myself and probably for you is, you know, your instinct, man, oh man. So I was at a store and they had the light and I was like, oh, you should buy it. You know, you could use it even if, you know, because the other one was sort of on the blink already and I didn't. And then a day or two later it died. And then, so I had to go, you know, out to a store, the same store to go get what I needed. And it's like, you should have just followed your instinct. I mean, it was $30 and it was like on super duper sale and it's enormous. I can make it six feet high and blah, blah, blah. Anyway, so for me, I'm getting trust your instinct, trust your instinct, trust your instinct. You know, if it, so maybe you're getting it too. Well, yeah, there is something instinctual about this reading. Knight of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, magician. This is a great reading. Great reading. Working, you know, uh, unmovable, very practical, very um, solid, you know, working towards something in the material world, you know, building a foundation with knowledge, you know. So if the knight who's the action guy, even though this is a funny um, knight in that he doesn't move, it's because he's in the material plane. So his action is much slower. It's much more steady. It's much more practical. It's much more um, secure. We get him a lot, we get him a lot. And then we get the king and the king is the businessman at the end of the day. But, you know, the king is the one who really understands uh, the power of money, how to use money, how to invest money. So I think, you know, this guy is working away on something in the physical world. Maybe you want to build something, you know, like furniture or uh, build a, a financial, um, a certain financial stability. And, you know, as you work, you become the king. As you, you know, you learn by doing. I mean, that's really the bottom line. You learn by doing. And then we get the magician. So the magician for me, it's a one, it's a leader. He's a leader. This is the one who really begins a story. You know, the fool is a zero. So he encompasses, I always feel like the fool is like the unborn soul in a way. Um, it's like he's picking up everything, the zero, he picks up, you know, the total, the totality. And then the one, he comes into being, right? 
So he has all the tools he needs. He's able to manifest from heaven to earth, you know, get this diagonal thing going. There's an eternal quality to him, just like there's an eternal quality to the soul, not an eternal, uh, eternal quality. The soul is eternal. But up. Um, I always feel like, so he, words are very important to this guy. To me, this is all about the words that we say to ourselves and we say out loud. So, you know, if we say to ourselves, well, I'm trying this and we'll see what happens, then, you know, you'll try it and we'll see what happens. But if you say to yourself, I'm working toward my future, toward being more financially stable, this is what I'm doing toward it. And it's already manifest. That's what he's about. So for me, he reminds me of, you know, I got all biblical. There, you know, the first time that God appears to Moses is through the burning bush in the desert, right? When he sees this bush, it's burning, it's not burning at the same time. It's a simultaneous weirdness, you know, kind of be, between the worlds in a way. And he's like, who are you? So God says his name and, and what it basically means, I am that I am. I am that was, I am that will be, I am. So, you know, the I am, if you ever work with the I am energy, you can look it up online. I am strong. I am powerful. I am talented. I am abundant. I am capable. I am, right? As opposed to, if you're saying negative things, I am so negative word. I am very negative word. <laughs> you know, we, we bring it into existence. It's as simple as that. So, uh, you know, I see myself going down that road, that negative thought road. Oh, I'm on negative thought road. Better make a Yui. I don't even know how to drive, right? You do something like that. And you turn around and get onto another road. And, you know, maybe that's what this is about, you know? It's like, if he's in the middle of building his foundation and he's like, we're a little too close to the creek, you know, that probably isn't really very stable. Don't be afraid to pull up the foundation and put it on top of the hill or you know what I'm saying. So watch what you're thinking, what you're building, and, and what you're thinking about what you're building. <laughs> okay. So that is what I have to say for the day. And interestingly, I, I mean, I wear a lot of pink and I wear a lot of green. Pink and green are really the, the this. And the, they're the ultimate, not, not that the other colors don't have power and they, they don't have, but these are the healing, these are the colors of healing. The colors of healing. So if you find yourself going down that road of I am, fill in the blank negative word, heal me, heal me of this thought. Heal me of this um, attitude. Replace, right? Because, you know, the thing that even though he's slow and steady, because the king is here, he's, you know, he could be in middle and he's like, you know what? We need the better windows. You know, we need the better windows. Or um, we're going to slant the roof at a different angle so that it's more um, uh, resistant to wind. Coming up with these building terms, I have no idea what I'm talking about. But you understand what I'm saying? <laughs> Who knows? You know, maybe in a year from now, I'm going to be one of those people who has like a video. You ever see those people who like, they're pretending they're living in the, in the, wilderness you know it's a little bit like Thoreau right I'm living in the wilderness you know but 15 minutes away you can go get you know uh internet and uh and a gallon of milk anyway <laughs>
blessings to you. Yeah, maybe I'll be building a log cabin in color. All right, maybe not. Uh, see you soon. So, you know, what we, what we, what we say aloud is what we manifest. Blessings. <laughs>